My name is Janusz Gilevich and uh, I'm an artist and I would like to welcome you to the show Col Visage, which is the collaborative work of the three artists, myself, Brett Roberts and Michael Ricardo Andrea. Uh, we are very happy to be here in that beautiful space and I would like to talk a few words about my work. This is a three-dimensional fish pound, koi fish pound, painted on the floor meaning that it was designed to be on the floor. What is interesting about this piece that it uses the MC Escher tessellation process. So if you look at the tile on the fish pond, are made entirely from the fish. Uh, the fish pond was made with the 3D glasses. And if you wear them, if you see the fish pond through the 3D glasses, you see that that space expands for approximately one to two foot. One of my latest work, which is a uh, Thinker and Narcissus, uh, it's the, based on the Rodin, uh, Rodin uh, Thinker, famous sculpture, and there is a woman looking at her reflection in the water. It's all covered by the, by the rain. Uh, it could be rain, it could be a uh, rings of the consciousness, but basically, it's my uh, subject matter called Deluge, which is, uh, you know, the concept I'm working on it based on Leonardo da Vinci concept of his last drawing before he died. He was, uh, this is this large piece over here. And I created the piece uh, last year and it was on my show. The interesting story is that model on that piece, I met, I met her 16 years ago. Her name is Sofia. I photographed her when she was 18 years old and, and then I painted her six years after but I lost contact with her. Thank you, thank you very much for your time and I hope you enjoy the work. Uh, hi, my name is Michael Ricardo Andreev. Um, uh, welcome to Visage. Uh, it's a collaborative exhibition uh, with three special artists, uh, Michael Ricardo Andreev, myself, uh, Brett Roberts, and Janusz Gilowitz. This piece in particular is called Lunar Eclipse. Uh, it's metal with uh, wood and painted with enamel paint, sign paints on wood. So I like to uh, incorporate the sculpture, the sculptural uh, kind of element in with the painting, so it has like this form and more volume. Yeah, and these, um, this piece is entitled uh, Solar Eclipse, um, and the same elements using the wood and using these, the wooden metal works as elements, as sculpture elements, and also as shelves, as props. And this again is uh, uh, it's called Birdcage, it's, it's coffee on paper, and I coated the coffee with paper and then continue to paint with coffee. This is, yes. Yeah, uh, this piece, this piece, this entire piece is called Starry Night. Um, along with the wooden metal pieces, along with this uh, central piece of wood in the middle uh, that's painted with uh, sign paint. Um, yeah, it's, it was initially called Study for Wetlands, but um, it's more Starry Night. Hi, how you doing? I'm Brett Roberts. Um, this is my painting here. And it's called Feeding the Multitude. And I painted it in Bed-Stuy, Brooklyn, in December and January. And I didn't think it was going to dry in time. And then somehow it just magically dried for the most part. And now, luckily, we got to hang it. And so this I didn't, is oil? This is oil on canvas. Yeah, it's about 10 feet by 9 feet, or something like that, ish. And um, I like to paint people. I've been painting crowds of people, um, sort of as an exercise to learn how to paint. 
because um, I think a lot of people just need a subject or they need, you know, they can't decide on what they actually want to paint, what's the subject, what's the style, but really you just need to paint. So I found something that I could, that I liked and that I enjoyed and I just started painting people because I love people, honestly. No matter how they treat me, I love so many people. I just do, I just do. <laughs> this one is called Manhattan Mosaic, part two. Uh, there's another painting called Manhattan Mosaic that I did, which, which is owned by Julie Chavez, who's a wonderful uh, lady I've known from LA, but then now she's in New York and does um, charities to help kids. Um, and she sells handmade jewelry to all around the world to help different different kinds of people. You can check her out, Julie Chavez. Um, this this one right here also was a auto, done on a recycled canvas, and. Um, that my friend Joey Baby, who's a, a great old friend and a, a wonderful sculptor. Hey, what's Joey Baby's full name? Zolkowski. Zbigniew Zolkowski. And he's really a legend. He's one of these guys that can find anything on the, on the New York City street. He's been doing it for years and he's been doing, making sculpture out of found objects. And he's a wonderful writer and a poet and kind of a artistic philosopher and, and I've been learning a lot from all these Polish guys, man, these wonderfully brilliant Polish artists that I had no idea that I would ever tap into this community, but they've been the most welcoming and cool people uh, since I've come back to New York City. It's like very touchy. Yeah. Uh, is uh, kind of an experiment with these checkers and um, these checkerboards and things started kind of, kind of coming into my work because I, they're really relaxing for me to paint just squares and and like uh, try to emulate some old looking like decayed uh, glass mosaic you know sort of thing to give you a window feeling of looking in this is called cerulean sunset and this is one of my most pungent kind of blue paintings that I'm really almost you know I'm just proud of the way it kind of really glows you know um, I don't know how this really can't happen to me. Yeah. That's yours, right? Yeah, yeah. But this is also a, a collaboration with you. It is? Yeah. Okay. Um, right. Listen, yeah. thank you very much. No, thank you, Odell. Salute, thank you. Thank you.